did and it was such a big story in the offseason will come under center for the first play from scrimmage and hand it off to Johnson who gets just a yard maybe to drive it vertically. I think they have to do that Todd. I don't even think it's a question. Play fake. Instead of looking downfield now will scramble. He does have some mobility and he gets the first down of the game settles him down. With the quick play and the handoff straight ahead with the big hole. There goes Johnson. Trying to fend off that. Carry on Johnson has a, a gimpy hamstring. Didn't look like he could open it up there. I think with the healthy hamstring. He scored five touchdowns last week against Missouri. All were from close range. On second to goal. Johnson picking his way ahead. Johnson stopped just short. Wow. Stidham will take the snap. Petway stood up. He did not get there. Gun. Stidham. Johnson. Touchdown. Designed to be. They ran it every time on their first possession and ended up in the end zone. They lead 7 0. And they'll hand it off. No, a fake. And a toss left side for fairly modest. Ryan Davis with his first catch, and they'll use him a lot in plays like that last one. Ousted him from under center. Looking deep, right side into coverage, and almost intercepted. Johnson alongside Stidham in the backfield. Stidham was looking to get rid of it quickly, now pressured, and he is hit. The ball comes loose and scooped up by the Bulldogs. Now the whistles come in. I think I heard a whistle. After review, the ball was fumbled with an immediate recovery by Mississippi State. The ball was placed at the 32-yard line. Game clock operator, please reset the game clock to 10:29. Now 10:29. Well, he he was he would bring his own pads to practice in the back of his pickup truck. He didn't have a locker and he didn't have a helmet, so he just kind of lived out of his out of his pickup truck. Rush affect him. That was what happened against Clemson, and it happened on the fumble in the last series. Straight ahead run, pass pro. Now the Wildcats set up here, and they're going to flick it back to Stidham with a wide open receiver downfield. The throw, underthrown a bit, but still completed down to. Ball was thrown out in front of Slayton, would have been an easy touchdown. Instead, 49 yards, first down Auburn. Johnson is a very patient runner, waited, and then went around the corner. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and the wind, the wind might be a factor. With blocking in front, diving to the pylon. Touchdown! A different feeling. When you decide to punt it as a head coach and then your punter booms it into the end zone and you net just 21 yards, do you regret the decision? Possibly. Maybe so. He's the blocker, the lead blocker for Carrion Johnson and Petway. Petway this time, who is so tough. To find where the ball's going. Here he is right here. Let's see if uh, this time the ball follows him. He, he does block and he picked up a rusher. That is complete. The question is. Can he stay in that pocket and go through his reads consistently? And off without a lot of room. In fact, negative yardage. Sealing the edge. Been impressive so far with the big Gugness. I agree. Straight ahead run on second down. Out to midfield and even. And Golson is their best offensive lineman along with Smith. Third and five. Pressure comes. Stidham just throws it away. Oh, leading 14 3 early second quarter. In the pocket, Stidham. Going deep, wide open, and caught! More like that. <laughs> First and 10, Auburn. Petway back in the game. We'll take the handoff. And he gets dragged down from behind. You see next oh, yeah. Saturday. They'll throw out the records game. Roll them out. <laughs> Where are we throwing them? That went out into the open space. That was a good. Still making a little adjustment to the play. Plenty of time to get it snapped. Stood him now, pressured, and he's going to go down. Trying to stay on his feet. And that's a that's an explosive offense. Over 20 yards, he's now two for three for 96 yards and a touchdown. And has spent a whole lot of time in the end zone, maybe when he was with the Spiders. Todd, <laughs> I'm a professional when it comes to ducks. That's why I knew. <laughs> <laughs> Always a quarterback. Third down Auburn. Johnson will get the first down. Play fake. 
almost like a zone read kind of yeah. play from high school. One of the reasons why he was so highly recruited. Started at Baylor, now at Auburn, and he's got arm talent, that's for sure. Stidham's over there on the left side. We've seen a, a trick play out of this formation or something similar this time. Just a wildcat run. Johnson stopped short on third down at a yard. Storylines from this college football Saturday, and it's a long way from being over. Straight ahead run for Auburn under a minute to go. Yeah. And much like Auburn, it starts with their defense. And just like Auburn's trying to find their right turn over here, get a stop. No kidding. Stidham in the end zone with all kinds of time going deep with a man caught into Mississippi State territory. Seven against Clemson. He just stood back there in the end zone for five seconds to survey the field. Only just completely changed field position at minimum, and now Auburn on the move, getting close to scoring territory. And off on second. Not had this, so I mean, <laughs> he's learning. I think right along with. Jarrett Stidham, what he's capable of. Under center, he's going to give it to Stove. That jet sweep for a first down and more. Eli Stove having a big game. In five different plays of 30 yards or more. And we got a long way to go. Johnson hit almost immediately. He lost drive started at the one, and not even really. Johnson again, this time bouncing it. Third and goal. Showing some pressure at the line. And they will bring pressure. Stidham over the top with contact. Knocked away. Pass interference. Defense number seven. That penalty will place the ball at the two-yard line. Automatic first down. But he, was, he was getting grabbed by Davis as well. He did not grab the jersey. I mean, he did have the hand behind. He didn't have a handful of jersey. Hand off straight ahead. Johnson. No signal yet. Touchdown. On our side of the ball, and so we followed up and said, "Well, who are those guys?" And he said, "Well, the number one is Trey Matthews, the safety. Pitch play out of the open field with a big hit, hanging on to the football. Toughness can't play in this league. 13 yards, hard earned. Stidham out to Ryan Davis, made a nifty move, but couldn't quite. On the left side of the huddle, from our perspective, you guys go out there. Now, this is the huddle they use when they go fast. Quick count." Forward, forward, shoulder forward. fake toward the end zone. It is a jump ball, almost caught, knocked away. An eligible receiver downfield. An eligible number was covered up on the play. That's against the offense. That penalty is declined. Third down. Third and 12. Stidham. There's some pressure coming this time to carry on Johnson gets upended. I think he's to get him going to have a little bit of spark on offense. Dan Mullen talked about that from last week. The 50-50 balls were not 50-50. The freshman, one of the best freshmen in the country, J.K. Dobbins, has yeah. taken over for the Buckeyes. That way has been real quiet in this game. Now the ball might have come out. Mississippi State saying they have it. And they do. At the receiver position, we, we mentioned Malik Deer, Gabe Miles, neither one playing this game. We're relying on some young players. Davis cuts it upfield. No Petway. Carry on Johnson in a running back. And he got stopped right at the line of got Cam Martin, De Devin Barrett. So, but they need to keep him engaged. Pressure coming. Stidham down the sideline. In stride. And Especially in the secondary, and they got beat. 53 yards, carry on Johnson. Stuffed in. They could use him. Illegal substitution defense. Too many. 12 minutes in formation. Half the distance. Second down. Second and goal. Johnson. Touchdown. He's got to finish this one out for Auburn. They like him. Problem for Malik is Jared Stidham. Sean White yep. still been here. But now you got to let him play some and, and get him ready just in case. A, a quick shot by Malik Miller. I look, Mississippi State is not Georgia's front. It's not Auburn's. It's not Alabama's. But the Bulldogs have some talented guys up front. And the Auburn off back, the backs who are supposed to pick up in protection, yeah. they, they made mistakes. Throw the ball too. away, yeah. yeah. Jet sweep play. 
case you wanted to hear a little of the uh, public address system. <laughs> That's a keeper. And there goes Willis. Malik Willis. Can he get there? Yes.